here we have a HP Spectre 15 X360 and the problem is the power light keeps blinking and will not turn on and doesn't matter what you do with the charger or battery um, nothing happens, nothing on the screen so we're going to see if we can fix this problem two screws, one on either side and the remaining screws are under the two long plastic strips on the top and the bottom apply a little bit of heat to loosen the adhesive and remove the long plastic strips and that will expose the remaining screws This is a very beautiful design laptop, so you want to be extra careful not to scratch or damage the bottom panel. So take extra care and slowly try and pry the bottom cover out.
From the initial inspection we can't see any physical damage such as liquid spill or burn marks or anything of that sort. That's the RSSD in there, it's a 1 terabyte. I'm not sure if it's NVMe or 2280, I think it is NVMe. Apply a little bit of heat on this too, remove it and see if you can expose anything. So I'm poking around looking for any burns or anything unusual to see if there is any problems maybe and I just don't see anything yet. So I get the multimeter to test if the DC jack is working, there is no issues with power supply and I'm getting the correct 19 volts which is a good sign. And then I'll check the battery to see if the battery is charged and there is charge on the battery and that was also good. So the next thing what you want to do is remove the power cable and the battery and press the power button for at least 10 seconds a few times. This part is optional but find a big chip somewhere around the board and short some of the pins all around it just to make sure there is no more power on any of the chips. Then put the battery back in and see if the system will turn on and it will take a little while to boot because the BIOS has now been reset and after the system does boot I do recommend doing another BIOS update ensure that it's working fine. And this is a good sign, the screen is showing that the BIOS has been reset and we need to press enter to continue. Now let's put everything back together and go onto the HP website, download the latest BIOS available and flash the BIOS.
now you can see the BIOS is currently being flashed and that was the end of this laptop thank you for watching hopefully this will help you with your HP Spectra BIOS frozen issues if you need any support or help you can always contact me and let's see what I can do for you thanks for watching please subscribe to support this channel